In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create this um, animating, uh, animated text that looks like this. It's kind of funky animated text, I guess. Um, I've had several requests for animated to for animation tutorials, so here's one. And now the only problem with this one is when I turn it into an animation, it causes the text to turn really pix like uh really not as smooth. Like this is the original text, as you can tell, it looks a whole lot better. But when I turn it into an animation, it's a whole lot more like pixelated, I guess you could say. I don't really know. Um, so to start out, just open up a new image and just type in whatever it is you want. Now the font I'm using is Nevis Bold, in case anyone is wondering. And now just aligning it to the middle by getting the alignment tool and pressing this um, the middle button on these two buttons, the align center of target and align middle of target. Now you're going to need to count how many letters are in um, in your word. Now the less letters, the better. So shorter words are definitely a lot easier to animate using this effect. So I have like what eleven letters? Yeah, eleven. So I'm just going to need to duplicate this ten times. So one less than how many letters you have. So, and to duplicate layers, you can just press this little uh, little icon at the bottom of your layers dialog. Or you can go to layers, duplicate layer. Now just hide all these layers. Um, hide all of them except for your original. And just make sure you, oops, make sure you select the original layer. Now what you're going to need to do is grab your eraser tool and I'm just gonna use the brush circle 19 I'm just turned up the scale a little and I erase all the letters except for your first one then grab your move tool and just move it a little I'm just using the up arrow key right now to move it a little then go to your next layer and do the same thing erase all the letters except for the second one like the next letter in your word and again, just move it using the move tool. And you might want to make it at a different level than the other letter. And as you can tell, this is a very tedious process. Um, so that's why it works a whole lot better on shorter words. And so that's pretty much how you would do that. Just go and erase and move every single letter. Now once you're done with that, let's just pretend I'm done, okay. Once you're done with that, you might want to um, edit the time of how long the, your last layer is there, because if I, um, and to do that, and the reason I'm going to do that is because if it's, so go to, uh, hold on, I'm going to explain this now. So you can, to preview your animation, go to filters, animation, playback. And just hit the play button and as you can tell your text is playing and only thing is sometimes on the last layer it shows the whole word and it goes by pretty fast so you might want people to be able to read it so I just edited the time of the last layer which will cause that last frame to stay a little longer do that just edit the name of your layer and at the end of it just put a parenthesis and then put in whatever time you want. I put in um, uh, 500 milliseconds. So just put in like whatever ms. I'm pretty sure the default time is 100 milliseconds. Uh, I'm not sure, but I think that's what it is. Then you're going to want to go to filters, animation, optimize for GIF. And that's just going to optimize it for a GIF image. And yeah, that's how you make your animating text. 